Hey guys, it's Jan, so welcome back. So I wanted to pop on here real quick um, to show you my face of the day because I really am loving the way it came out today. Um, and the lip combination I found quite by accident. I was actually looking for a different red lipstick. I was planning on doing red, and then I found this one quite by accident, and it's a new lipstick I completely forgot I had. But I'm standing up, so my phone might be a little bit shaky um, because I'm in my window area, and it's allowing for the natural light so you can really see um, what I'm loving about this whole look. And what that is is the brightness of the blush, which I went a little bit heavier with today, and the brightness of the lipstick, which I'm absolutely loving. So the blush is Milani's Luminoso. It's just one of the prettiest blushes I've ever tried. I mean, I really, really love this blush. And um, I went higher on my cheekbones. So I, I do kind of have higher cheekbones, but I wanted to accentuate that even more. And I brought it down on my nose and across my forehead, under my chin. And I followed up with a quick dusting of Guerlain's um, terracotta light 03 brunettes bronzer but I think just the heavier application of the luminoso today did wonders for me I usually go a little sparingly with it um, but I wanted a brighter look that's what I was going for and I knew I wanted a pink um, lip or a red lip but I knew I was using a red lip liner so I knew it was going to come out somewhat red and um, but I wanted the peach cheek and that red look, and I really am loving the way this came out today. Um, on my eyes, I have Galapagos in the crease. It's one of my favorite browns, and I even did that a little bit differently today, too. Not the Galapagos, but uh, the color above it, which is my um, brow bone color. I usually just use... Um, a soft matte white or something along those lines. Today what I did was I used my Milk Jumbo Pencil by NYX on my brow bone and then I went in the inner corner and on the outer edge and blended it in um, with um, All That Glitters by MAC which is a real pretty subtle shimmer beigey, champagne-y, pinky kind of champagne-y color. And I blended that into my brow bone. Um, not over the white in the middle, so it's kind of like here, it's there, and I kind of just slightly, you know, just buffed out the edges of the white. So it's white, and then all that glitters, Galapagos, Giorgio Armani Eyes to Kill on my lid, Galapagos under my eyes, Black Track Fluid Line winged out, and uh, Maybelline's XXL Pro Collagen Volume something. I can't remember the name of it. And then I took my Luminoso and I went high on my cheeks, down my nose, um, and I have no highlighter on because it's the wonderful thing about the Luminoso that you really don't need a highlighter with it. Um, so that's the eyes, that's the cheeks. A little Guerlain, like I said, bronzer, as a light dusting all over just to incorporate, you know, just to buff out the edges of the Luminoso. But I, I went a little bit heavier, like I said, and I really do love that brightening effect on my face. But when I put this lipstick on, I mean, I was going for Crosswires by MAC, but when I was going through my makeup drawer and I came across this, this is Bombshell by MAC, and I absolutely, I don't know if you can see it at all, if I have it upside down. It's Bombshell by MAC, and the lip liner is NYX 817 Hot Red. So I outlined first, and then went in with this, and history was made for me. I mean, seriously, I absolutely am in love with this lip combination, and it just really brightened me up. I love it. Um, and then I went underneath with my Benefits Well Rested under my eyes. So I went for a brighter look today. I went for a red lip, lip today. I wanted that peach cheek today, and I love peach and red together. I think they work really well. Um, and yeah, I'm just keeping everything else really, really simple. Um, my outfit is just this black, you know, long dress. I think it's by Julie's Closet. And my nail polish is this Maybelline Color Show in Born With It, number 150. Which the color's pretty, but the formulation I really don't like. Um, jewelry is... Um, Simple today, Coco Wagner on Etsy is where I got the sideways cross. I'm trying to keep my phone steady because I am standing in front of the natural light in the window. Um, trying to, you know, simulate some sort of blingy firework kind of look, you know, with my ring. My Henry Bendel 
cuff, um, Franco Sardo sandals, ones that remind me of Italy. And my bag is going to be my Sam Edelman, just to match kind of the ring and my lids. But um, that's the best right there, at least I'm seeing in, in the phone, of how the makeup looks, you know, in terms of the brightness. This, right now, the lighting is really hitting it perfectly, I think. And I just absolutely have to rave about this lipstick. If you have it, try it with a red lip liner. It's so pretty. I love it. So I just wanted to pop on here and show you my face of the day. And um, sometimes going a little bit heavier with, um, you know, a blush or whatever really can make things, you know, pop, especially when you add a little bit of a white and then mute the white out and, you know, highlight. I just I love this. So this will be a tutorial. I don't know when I'm going to do it, but this will be a tutorial using my Galapagos, which I know I love. And um, I hope you like this, guys. So enjoy your 4th of July. Stay safe, and I will see you in my next video. Bye!